x equals 4096 to the power 7 plus 4 root 3. Which of the following equals 64? Now, there's a bunch of things where being numerically comfortable is very helpful. 64 square is 4096. This is 2 power 6. This is 2 power 12. That is helpful. So, this square root idea involved here somewhere. And so, x can be written as 64 square whole power 7 plus 4 root 3. Wonderful. So, that is that is that that could be helpful. Fine. The second thing, which of the following equals 64? So, we still don't know how to get to 64 from here. And so, we can say square root of x is 64 to the power 7 plus 4 root 3. Or square root of x to the power 1 by 7 plus 4 root 3 is 64. 1 by 7 plus 4 root 3. 7 plus 4 root 3 is a beautiful number. Because 7 plus 4 root 3 into 7 minus 4 root 3 is 7 square 49 minus 16 into 3, 48, which is 1. The reciprocal of 7 plus 4 root 3 is 7 minus 4 root 3. Or square root of x to the power 7 minus 4 root 3 is 64. Where, how do we get there? Okay, this is x power 7 by 2 by x power 4 by 3. This is x power 7 by 2 minus 4 by root 3. Sorry, it should be 4 root 3. It's given incorrect. It should be 4 root 3. Then, no, 4 by root 3. 4 by root 3. That doesn't work. 4 by root 3. It's tough to reconcile. This is x power 7 minus 4 root 3. This is also incorrect. We square root of x power 7 minus 4 root 3. This is x power 7 by 2 minus 2 root 3. Yep. This is x power 1 by 2 whole power 7 minus 4 root 3. This choice works brilliantly. Choice A, if it had been 4 root 3, we would have exploded. It is 4 by root 3. So we don't have to worry about it. Choice C takes us to 7 x power 7 by 2 minus 2 root 3 or x power half whole power 7 minus 4 root 3. Numerical friendliness, being friendly with picking that 7 plus 4 root 3 and 7 minus 4 root 3 are reciprocals. 4096 is 64 square. That really pays off. So it's a, it's a cruel question if you can't pick that.